Hello everyone. Now in this series of videos, we are going to learn something about Arduino, and we are going to construct many other projects. So first of all, we'll talk about Arduino. This is Arduino Uno, and there are other variants as well, like Arduino Mega, Arduino Nano, Arduino Mini, etc. So we'll use this one. This is Arduino Uno. it has 14 different digital input output pins you can see from pin number 0 to pin number 13 and there are six different pwm pins pwm stands for pulse width modulation this sign indicates that this particular pin is pwm pin it has six channel analog to digital converter from a0 to a5 and this is our controller ic at mega 328p there are two electrolytic capacitors this is our crystal oscillator and ftdi ic this is our programming cable usb uh, usb pin d type this is our reset button this button is used to reset the execution this is our power pin it allow maximum of 12 volts and minimum voltage required is 5 volt to power up this device uh, and if in case we don't have this type of pin there is V in pin in our power section. Using this V in pin and ground, we can power up this device. Same minimum voltage is five and maximum allowed voltage is or maximum recommended voltage is twelve. This is five V pin. Five V stands for five volt. There are many sensors that require five volts to get powered up. For example, IR sensor or ultrasonic sensor. So with the help of this pin, we can power up them. and the, this is 3v3 pin that means 3.3 volts pin because there are some devices that use 3.3 volt to get powered up for example bluetooth module wifi module esp8266 nrf etc so now we are going to learn how to program this arduino uno board so to program this you have you need to have a software called arduino so this is the programming software If you don't have the software, you can download it from Arduino.cc. It is open source software and available for free. So this is the first screen that appears. You can see there are two things written: white setup and white loop. We'll discuss them one by one. In white setup, between these two brackets. in white setup we need to declare our different pins that is which pin we are using as input and which pin we have use, we are using it as output for example i'll write pin mode 13 comma output and after each statement we need to use semicolon that means termination of the statement this statement means that pin number 13 will be used as output pin so our pin number 13 has been declared as output and in void loop we'll enter our main code over here between these two bracket and that code will be executed repeatedly for infinite time in this i'll write digital right 13 comma high so this pin number 13 goes high after executing this command and uh, if i want to make a blink program so i'll give a delay of say 500 millisecond this is delay in milliseconds and then semicolon and after that digital write 13 comma low so this takes pin number 13 to low and after that we need to give again a delay of 500 milliseconds 
and after executing this command your board will execute this first command again so after execution of last statement the first statement will be executed and then second then third and so on so this means it makes a loop so this is our basic blink led program i have used pin number 13 because i have one smd led internally connected to pin number 13 so if pin number 13 goes high this led will glow so to program this i would require a d type usb cable i'll connect this and connect this pin to my pc so once i connect this the screen led glows on and it indicates the power now before programming this go to tools and select your board so this is Arduino UNO and then select port com port 4 so whichever port is available those will be displayed over here and you need to select Arduino port so in this case it is com 4 now click on this upload button this arrow stands for upload button first it will ask to save this so i'll save this if you don't want to save you can click cancel and then it will start to compile your sketch this is your progress bar and once this is full your sketch will be compiled and if there is any error it will show error in this area so now it is uploading and once the program up is uploaded then uploading will be displayed in this bar and you can see our LED is blinking now if I change this delay the, this blinking becomes fast So blinking speed has increased you can see this is the basic programming of Arduino hope you like this video please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel